The final of the... And so it comes down to this. Welcome to our coverage of the final here at the Euros. My name is Derek Ray, sitting here on the commentary gantry. And with me to provide expert analysis, a complete tactical breakdown, is Stuart Robson. What a match this promises to be. It's Portugal versus Poland. Well, Derek, I'm really excited by these two teams. There are some top-class players all over the pitch and some really good matchups. This could be a great final today. Let's hope so. He has time to play it over. Well, it still could be dangerous. And nicely struck. Well, the goalkeeper's life wasn't made quite as difficult as might have been the case. Well, then the accuracy department leaving a bit to be desired. Here's how it looks for Portugal. Bernardo Silva plays alongside Bruno Fernandes in central midfield. And leading the attack today is Cristiano Ronaldo. That's a lovely ball. And he successfully got past him. And it's teed up for Ronaldo. The opening goal in the final. And how important could that be as a direction pointer? Well, here's the replay, and just look how quickly they break forward once they win the ball back. And I have to say, the finish from Ronaldo is just brilliant. He's such a good technician. It's a wonderful goal. So, underway again here. 1-0 the score. Adam Buxa. Piotrowski on the ball. Buxa. Lewandowski. And now Zielinski. Lewandowski. Zielinski. Piotrowski on the ball. Now the attack fizzled out. And he really read that brilliantly. Felix. On to Bruno Fernandes. It's Bernardo Silva. Good piece of defending. Nuno Menj. And Palinha with it. Bernardo Silva. On to Bruno Fernandes. Will it be? Portugal have control of the ball again here. Sebastian Szymanyski. Now with Silva. Diaz, Minch, Joao Cancelo, Portugal pushing forward with options available, can he put it away, and there it is, a two goal cushion now, and just look at these fans, the trophy coming their way, surely. Well here's the replay. He does well to find that bit of space in the box and then he shows a lot of composure to finish it off. That's a good goal. So underway again and a 2-0 advantage here. Piotrowski. Zielinski. Pepe, it's with Joao Cancelo, Joao Cancelo, oh how about that for the last line of defence, Palinha, Portugal looking dangerous, and it's teed up for Ronaldo, 
And the post denied him. And able to close down the shots. Well, so close to extending their lead there. Just a matter of inches. Ronaldo. And it's teed up for Ronaldo. Is it going to be? Well, not an effort for his own personal scrapbook. Davidovic. Well, they have the ball once more. Oh, genuine chance. And he's made it a brace for himself. The defender is just unable to stay with him. And he's having a field day. Well, here it is again. And he's just passed that into the net. That's a very good finish, you have to say. So the action continues, and Portugal very much bossing the proceedings here. Zalewski. It's with Joao Cancelo. Silva. Cancelo. Targets available, Cross comes in. Sound piece of defending. Zielinski. And that'll be a Portugal throw. Mensch. It's with Joao Cancelo. Bruno Fernandes. What to like about that pass? He's got the score! Well, he clearly wants to complete his hat trick, Stuart. Well, he's been fantastic up to now. You'd think it's going to come if he gets another opportunity. And the electronic board showing one additional minute. And Ronaldo takes on the shot. And so it is, the first half story has been written. So back underway here into the second half. Nothing untoward happened. Rafael Leao. Nice looking pass. Nikola Zalewski. Can they hit on the break? Well, nothing comes of it. It looked promising. Rafael Leao. Superb looking pass. And a goal! There he is at the double. They just can't subdue him.
Well, here it is again. It's a wonderfully weighted ball over the top. And Ronaldo finishes it with so much quality. Just look how much power he hits this with. It's a top-class goal. A lopsided contest, 4-0. Szymanyski, Szemysław Frankowski, giving the ball to the opposition that time. Outrageously skillful, and nobody there to pick him up in the center. Not too fussy in clearing his lines. Davidovic, Bednarek. Frankowski. And space to exploit, maybe. Seem to just lose control of the situation. He's conceded a corner. They take it short. A top-notch piece of defending. Bodies forward and the break looks on. Well, they promised much on the break, but ultimately delivered little. Adam Buxa. The defenders know you can't really allow space like that. Pepe. Oh, goodness. Not the best of challenges. Now then, what's the referee going to do here? Well, the misery continues. Quite simply, Stuart, he had to go. Well, I think that sums up their day. A complete lack of discipline from everybody involved. Bench. An alert intervention. Good bit of closing down. Szymanyski. They might be able to get in now. And Portugal have it back now. Ruben Dias. Mensch. Palinha. Spraying passes around, almost waiting for the opposition to make a mistake. Bernardo Silva. Felix. And hit with ferocity. It was close, but not quite good enough. Poland come away with it. Jakub Piotrowski. And into the last 15 minutes of action. Silva. It's with Joao Cancelo. Bruno Fernandes has it. Beautiful pass. It comes to nothing in the end. And Bernardo Silva has it. And an effective clearance. Well, it looks so promising, but a goal kick the outcome. Yeah. 
Leal. Really fine piece of defending play to break us up. Breaking at pace. Oh, nice ball over the top. And it was a good counter attack in the making, but very alert defending. And not a great. Great challenge, free kick here. Oh well, you can't get them right every time, and he got that one very wrong. Yeah, it's a poor free kick, I have to say. What was he thinking? He was never going to score from there. Passes like that, very much in his repertoire. Ruben Neves, and that puts them in position. Making sure nothing came of it. Ferreira. Jota and that is how to block safe pair of hands did his job doing everything possible to keep possession and all the way through to the keeper Vitor Ferreira Minch. Well, we are going to have a decent amount of stoppage time. Three minutes to be exact. Sebastian Szymanski. Well, made it look routine, but read it well. A foul, but advantage played. Zalewski. And there goes the final whistle! Portugal have won the Euros on this dramatic night here in Berlin. The joy, the ecstasy, also the disappointment, but ultimately the feeling of togetherness. Well, I have to say, they've been brilliant throughout the tournament. They were great today as well. They are the deserved champions, no doubt about that. And these are very special scenes that we're witnessing. And now, with the pressure off, a chance to reflect, a chance to celebrate, the trophy about to be presented. The European champions, Portugal! What a great moment for these players. Absolutely brilliant. And it doesn't get any better than this, does it? A chance now to celebrate with their own fans. And the fans have also played their part. Just listen to the noise here. Great end to this tournament.